everybody today what we're going to do is we're going to go over a pretty popular question i have that comes from uh, a lot of my uh, my newer students which is how to forward your domain name um and mask it um so what we're going to do is we're going to use godaddy as an example uh, obviously because GoDaddy is one of the more popular places that people go to to register their domain names. So the first thing you're going to do after you're logged in is click on my account. There's a couple ways to do this, but um, this way is pretty simple. Um, once you go to my account, you'll see the screen here, and you click on domain, scroll over domain names, excuse me, and then click on where it says manage domains. Apologize for the delay here, but um, let's see. Now what we'll do is <laughs> you probably don't um, have 99 domain names there, but uh, I'm going to scroll down uh, to the domain name that I'm going to use here as an example. And the reason I'm using it as an example, it's actually another tip that I have for people. I recommend that you get your own name. Um, as a dot com, at least a dot com, and um, let's see if you click on that, you click on the actual domain name here, and once the next screen comes up, and folks, I'm not on dial up. <laughs> Once the uh, once the next screen comes up, what you're gonna do is you'll see up here where it says forward. So you'll click on forward, okay. Now, here you're at the page where you're going to enter all your information. So you're going to put in, and I use for this example, I use one of the blogs that I have. Again, you could forward your domain to whatever you choose, but I'm forwarding this one to one of my blogs. Um, I'm moving it temporarily. Um, you just type in, make sure you put the HTTP colon slash slash um, of the domain. So that what that's going to do is when someone clicks on moriwilkes.com, that's going to take them to my blog. And you may want to do this, like, obviously, if you have an affiliate program, you have an affiliate link, you would forward your domain name to an affiliate link because you don't want to be advertising your affiliate link. Um, you always want to have your own domain name. Now, when we click on masking up here, this is where, you know, a lot of people have some questions, you know, how you get the, um, what's on the top of the, the very top of the page. That's in your title. So I could put anything out, anything here, uh, Maury Wilkes Internet Marketing Tips, um, and that would come up at the very, very top of, of your screen. Um, the key, the meta tags, um, you know, there's different theories on this. Um, like you could really get into it and do some keyword research um, for whatever you're advertising and put a bunch of um, tags in here on your right and then just a little description here of what you're advertising and then you click on OK okay now I've already done this so I don't have to actually click on OK but let me just show you um, where it takes you to okay it's going to take you to where it's it's processing okay and then you're going to click OK here again down the screen. Okay, now GoDaddy does take a little while once you do this um, um, for it to actually go into effect. Uh, but since I had already done it, I'm going to type in the top of my screen MaureenWilkes.com.
and that is going to forward me um, to my blog here. So that is uh, domain forwarding, and um, I'll see you next time.